I wondered how the bread turned that brown, and just the size of my fist. Where does its name Pandasal come from? What does it mean? Good morning, ma'am. I'd like to buy Pandasal. Okay, it will be ready for you. Oh, sure. I'll be waiting here. Thank you, ma'am. Good morning, Alan. I love staring at her. She's beautiful. Her charm makes me smile whenever I see her. I really love playing my violin. It's my safest and comfort. I am having a great time learning with Mr. Castaldi, my violinist teacher. I watch you playing your violin. You're so good at it. Would you mind joining my private band? I'm telling you, you should join. Oh, sorry, but I have school to do. We have many projects. We will play at the funeral of a Chinese and Judge Roald Dunn's silver wedding anniversary. I'm thinking about the money I'll earn from this. I want to buy stationery for Ida to feel every piece of paper with my feelings. Okay, I'll join. Thank you for this. I dreamed of returning from a tour. I am a cover of the magazine and winning Ida's hand. But... Why do you want to be a musician? Don't you know? For my aunt, my violin is just an excuse. Upon hearing those remarks from my aunt, I couldn't do anything but feel the thorns of pain poking me one by one. I continued to practice with the Min Blues Orchestra despite it. And then suddenly, I felt that I wanted a brooch for Aida. So I looked for it, but I didn't find any. Until now, my thoughts about my feelings for her have been unwritten. Even the brooch, I don't have one for her, as I don't know what brooch to give. There you are. I want to inform you that our It made me happy to know that our band was invited to a prestigious event according to me. And now, we are in front of Don Esteban's house, oh, ready we're to play. Now. Yes, let's go inside. I saw the ladies being confident in what they were wearing, and then we recommended to play the power and peasant of each other. She's wearing a white dress, simple yet stunning from anyone else. I couldn't take my eyes off of her, and she commanded the two servants to bring the instruments near us. My heart jumped to my throat. After the presentation of Alicia and Josefina, we were thinking about dinner. I was with my friends, that's why I was not shy to eat that night. Have you eaten? Uh, if you'll wait until everyone is gone, I, I can pack you a big package. It's okay, thank you. I know that she saw me wrapping food. The reality hit me that Ida and I were just meant for my dream. We separated with our instruments, but Pete and I went at the bakery to buy a bread. I am just like this bread, a bread that is not for everyone, a bread that tells me every now and then my status.
a bread that needs to undergo many hardships to be ready. Yeah, I am just like this bread. And every pinch of salt it has defines me. How beautiful my life is. And I just woke up crying. I remembered all the things that happened that night. My love that screamed in silence for a long time. Just lost because of embarrassment. This bread is me. And with every bite I take, I can completely taste the salt in me.